Hey, what's up? Skinny Jean Gardeners here for episode number two of Seed to Sunset. You might remember last time we built the veg truck outside. Now we're in the potting shed and we're going to get some seeds in some soil. Let's go! Okay, here we are in the potting shed. Now, some of the seeds that we're planning to grow in our veg truck need to be started off inside. Okay, so you can do it in a potting shed like this, a conservatory, a greenhouse, or even your windowsill. The first thing you need to do is to find um, a container to sow those seeds into little green shoots. Um, look, can you, you can use these. You can use plastic trays just like this. Uh, we've got pots just like this. Um, or you can recycle cardboard tubes. Let me show you how you're going to do this. First of all, you need to get some scissors and you're going to cut this tube in half just like this. like that okay and then we're going to cut one two three and fold it in on itself like so. really simple really 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 easy um, put another one just in there okay Okay, and there you have it, a very simple recycled pot for your seeds to go in. Okay, there we have it, the pot is ready. Next up, we need to get some compost, like so, and you can try and be careful, but it doesn't really matter. Anyway, okay, there we go. So it's filled up with compost. Then we're going to get our seeds. Um, now, as we said before, not all of the seeds that are going in the veg truck need to be uh, placed inside, first of all. Uh, but the way these ones are, these are tomato seeds. So let me just show you these. They're very tiny. So we want to get about three or four of these tiny, delicate little seeds and sprinkle them on top. We'll save those ones for later. Um, once that's done, we want to give it a little sprinkle of compost on top. Okay, now only a little sprinkle. Don't go crazy with that. Okay, next up, it's time to give them that initial water. Now, we don't want to be using a watering can because if we do that, then it might um, move the seeds about. So we're going to use a mister. So from a distance, I'll get my little mist. Perfect. And these are ready to start growing. Now Dale's done with the tomato seeds, he's going to do exactly the same with the chilli seeds and the cucumbers. I'm going to be out there with the carrots. Let's make it easy for ourselves. Let's make some seed tape. What are you going to need? Obviously toilet roll, some flour, water and a few essential pieces of equipment which we'll go through later. Firstly, let's make our paste, our gluey paste for the seeds to go on. All you're gonna need, you're gonna put a bit of flour in and just a little bit of water. Like I said, it needs to be gluey. So that's probably, it's a bit wet. Let's put a bit more flour in there. And give it a good mix. Here we go, look at that. Love that. Let's leave that over there and get our toilet roll. Spread it out to the about the length of your veg truck or how long you want to plant your seeds. We'll just cut that there. And then cut it straight down the middle. Once that's done, we're gonna get rid of that bit and save it for later. We've got our strip here. Get your bit of glue and just dab it on how far you want your seeds. So you don't have to use this for carrots, you can also use it for other seeds as well. But today I'm gonna to use it for carrots so I can save my seeds and evenly spread them out. It's gonna stop you having to thin out too much as well. So we're just going all the way along there. 
Now for the important things, the seeds. Get a nice little handful and we're gonna put about one, two, maybe three seeds on each blob of glue. Like those. So when these start coming through the ground, you can thin out on each step. Lovely. Now, save them. Just simply fold it over on itself and these can go straight into the ground. Sometimes I do this over winter when I'm not up to much. All you gotta do is just roll them up and store them in a cupboard ready for the season to start. And there we have it. Seed tape made at home. Let's get it in the garden, shall we? Now we're back down by the veg truck. We've got our seedlings going on up in the pot and shed. Now it's time to get some seeds into the soil. What we've got take, to do, Lee? Take these, bro. We're going to put salad leaves, okay? Just take two lines down next to each other and thinly sow out your seeds. Okay, I've got it. When these start boshing through the soil, you need to thin them out a little bit because no one likes to be too crowded out next to each other. <laughs> Let's just cover that back over, give it a water, and wait and see. Check these guys out straight from the potting shed. It's time to get them planted in the veg truck. Okay, first the Tommies, here we go. Now for the chilies. These guys are ultra cool. Let's get the cucumbers in. So there we have it, we're a little bit closer from going from seed to sunset. Join us on our next episode where we'll be looking after and tending to our plants. And don't forget to subscribe. So, we want to know what your top tips are for sowing and growing. Join a conversation on Facebook and Twitter.